smoke rounds. Recycle those because I don't need those. All right, I'm gonna stand creeping over toward the marker. You All guys right. catch up when you're ready. Oh, do I or you guys know about the Reaper? Yeah, what about him? No. Oh, you don't know about the Reaper? Okay, no. so there is a random chance if you are over a certain level and the area is over a certain level. The more you kill machines in an area, the, the higher the level gets, the more dangerous it becomes. You bring the level back down by killing rivals, but a special one can spawn. It's a black tank, and it has super abilities. It's the closest thing to a boss this game actually has. It apparently has shields, so there are times you just can't damage it, and it has a ton of health. And it has extra attacks that other tanks don't have, including one where it can just kill you in one shot. Yeah, <clears throat> I did my research on this boy. Yeah, you have to have the level over fifteen. I yeah, believe. and only one of them can spawn. Let's try stuff. not to piss anything off between here and there because we're probably going to get into a big fight when we show up. Yeah, the fly boy here is going to cause us a lot of trouble. Well, only if he sees us. Oh, I gotta keep keep low, keep low. Yes. Yeah, oh yeah, he's looking for us. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them above us. Yes, I see. They're paired. Like a couple of nuggets dropped in the toilet. <sighs> it's poop know, day. Shit. It's a shitty joke, I know. Yes, it is. Go to the coordinates the tracking device is sending its data to. Death from above. So something tells me we're going to fight a lot of flying things. Oh, that? Yeah, that's our quest. Death from above. It's a side quest. It's where the number one marker is there taking is us. There is an undiscovered safe house, safe house slightly like to up left. to the uh, east of you guys. Yeah, to our left, Rob. Go to it. Okay, I see. We're probably going to need it. <laughs> yeah, it'd probably be a good idea to activate that before we get into the big fight. All right, I believe the safe house is below us. It's probably because they kind of got a, a tickle of me. Nope, something saw me. And I'm crouched. Oh, I don't shit. exactly know where the safe house is might be under the hill. I think it is, and I think I'm about to fall off the hill. Oh, I did. I died. Yeah, you did. I'm going to use an adrenaline shot. No, I'm good. I'm good. I just used adrenaline, so now I can get to the safe house. Oh, uh, well, I see something down there. There's something red glowing in the woods below us. And theoretically, if I find oh, it, then I you guys can just warp that. to it. Nope. I'm about to fall and die, too. Yep. Oof. Okay, got the safe house. <laughs> Alright, so you guys can warp to the safe house now. You should be able to just get here. We're in a cave. Well, that's good. Alright, but now we gotta yeah. figure out how to get back to... up there to get to the mission. I know where we're at. In trouble? I ain't warping nowhere because apparently a hunter just spotted me. Uh, I just got spotted by the flying thing, so I think I'm about to get into combat. Hey, Wood. Oh, yeah, I see where you guys are. Where you at, Flyboy? Oh, yeah, bud. And that's really a beacon? There must it be a bomb right above over us. us. Yeah, there are bombs floating in the air. I'm gonna try and get a vantage point on this guy. Alright, we're in combat. It's kind of a good advantage for us because we're not trying to piss anything off. Well, who knows? These might be the things that we're supposed to fight anyway. Incoming. Oh. Okay. I can come get you. Rob's on his way. Well, we do have a safe house, like, I've right there. At, yeah, I died at the entrance to the safe house. I mean, we would have as well just respawn in the I safe house. Dogs. I'm not worried about dogs. Dogs is easy. Oh, please. 
or no, not dogs, uh, seagulls. I heard seagulls. Or that provocation thing that they do. Ooh! Yeah, since we got a safe house, like, right here, it doesn't make any sense to waste med packs or anything. We'll just respawn. <clears throat> Which means that we can just go all out because we don't have to worry about dying! We'll just respawn. You hear that game? We're technically immortal. You can't kill us permanently. You running away? We've got bullets for days and a safe house to respawn at. Yes, he did. Because he's afraid, because they pulled out the big gun. I was waving it around, he was like, all right, time to go. I got smacked by something. I got smacked by something. Something shot fire at me. So be aware. Yeah. Be aware. Wait, how come uh, I can't respawn right at that safe house? There we go. Spawn there. Roly polies. Yeah, it was the roly poly behind you, Rob. I see it. I see it. Where to go? Where to go? So where's the big boy? Where's the one in the air? Oh, what the hell was that? Yeah, there's gotta be a, a wolf tank out there spawning these things. Here we go. Thanks above us. Well, let's take care of this guy first. Shit. Did we accidentally destroy the beacon? No, I think that was the other fly boy. Yeah, there's two of them, all right. There is two of them. Oh, one down. There it is. That was the gun I was looking for. Everything and run. Pretty much, yeah.
Alright, well I got a tuned bulkhead for that thing. Yeah, I got one of those earlier. Yeah, it just respawned at the safe house. Okay. I mean, that's kind of why we decided to do this. Is you could just spawn here at the safe house, you didn't have to worry about resources. Yeah, you gotta clear the airspace and all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know, he found me. About to come res you. Nah. nah, nah, nah. Just spawn. Just respawn. No wasting uh, med packs or crap on this fight. They picked the they picked the wrong place to fight. Honestly, that's what it is. Is they're fighting right next to a spawn point for us. It's like, hey, thanks for that. Yeah, There's I know. So much going on. We do that often. Where the heck is the thing in the air? Oh, there he is. Ah, uh, he dead. Yeah. Okay. Finally. Yeah, I've been laying in him for a while. Hey, where's his corpse? Over by me. A drone shot rubber. Five uranium. Alright, well, I didn't get um, anything that great, but I did get a bunch of ammo from him. Now, you guys said there was a tank as well? Oh, I'm overweight now. Tuned moped. 50 BMG. Oh, my. It's all the good stuff I can't say no to. I have uh -huh. 312 BMG full metal jackets. Uh. Alright. Let's. Do I have? 174 armor piercing. Let's start heading back toward what we were doing. 500 full metal. So I'm gonna try and head toward the number one point now. Oh, I need to start using my BMG. Lose some of that. Yeah. Room. Okay, I, I found hear, the point. I another one. Should be. Yeah, it's probably because over over by where I am. Yeah. I'm oh, there's a base here. I see a base. This is what we're doing. We're taking out a base. Oh, flyboy! I see no nothing, and he didn't see me. Now I oh, now he sees me. Nothing saw me. I have no windows. I'm point four seven seven pounds overweight. Oh, I got a dual low light IR module. If anyone needs it. No, we're good. Uh, we're good. We have combat, though. Oh, I can't see it. Oh, come on! You can't hit me? You kind of suck at this. Is that thing already on fire? You found me. You're on your own, Rob. That's fine. Just I get back when you can. I mean, we've got the spawn point right there. Might as well manipulate the crap out of it. Yeah, I'm never gonna use the sidearm. I might as well just store it. Yes! Don't take any sidearms with you. Never need them. 
You will never use it. Oh, let's say maybe about six pounds. All right, so now where are you guys at? Uh, running around trying not to die. Well, actually, I'm just trying to find the target. It knows where I am. I just can't figure out where I he is. There he is. He's got some electrical mines on the ground, too, so watch out for those. Oh, oh they I just zapped the shit out of you. Stop shooting the shit over by me. I'm literally close to the, the safe house. Oh, Got okay. Him. Don't let your guard down. I think there's other stuff out here. Okay. Okay. I'm going over the hill with the drop. <laughs> I'm going after the base. It's not one of those kind of bases. We actually have to climb in this one. Well, I'm trying to kick the lights out. That's number one. The lights don't yeah, die. Uh, yeah, this is uh, not one of those bases. Class. <laughs> I'm fucking with that, it's Phoenix. Yes, this way, Rob. So we have to we climb into this thing? Yeah, we go in. <clears throat> right here. Okay. I'm waiting for Tom. I am trying to get up the hill to where you guys are. Oh, I see, you can jump okay, up in here. here. I'm on the over other here, side over of here, the over wall. Here, over here, over here. That's strange. Soviet equipment inside the Phoenix camp. Come on. The side of base. Oh, wait. I heard someone talking about a Soviet captain who's working with the Phoenix machines. Could this be her place? Don't let your guard down. Yeah, there's ticks around here all the place. You can hear them. Oh, well, if that's the case. This is a good time to be using my, uh, my schnotty. Schnotty into your love muscle. Yes. Come this way. Ah, uh, I hear a hunter. Yeah, they're outside. Go up the ladder. Oh, over here we got some food. Should be something you guys over here. Right here, right here, right okay. here. Okay. Uh, Tatiana's notes. Phoenix keeps updating the code to the computer room, and I do not want to admit it. I'm incapable of memorizing it. This place feels like a prison. I know that I need Phoenix's help if I remember to gain control or back over the mechanical units, but these black wells make me wonder. What if I've become its prisoner? Nights are the worst. I stare at the sweeping red lights, always ready to defend me so that I can continue my work. Sometimes I envision a Swedish survivor entering those lights. I do not think I could stop Phoenix from firing in the dead of night. I pretend that it's me standing in the red lights as the guns fire. The firebird should take all my focus, but I feel distracted. It is a monster. I remember when they started working on it. The development team filed complaints about the bombs. It seemed like the complaints were not listened to. It's a machine of destruction and death, nothing else. My country built a machine of annihilation, and yet I think as much about these black walls as I do about how to incapacitate the firebirds. I need to get my priorities straight. I cannot lose focus. I think I need air. And then it's all got right, a bunch of passcodes. Yeah. There's a couple, there's like four or five roly pulleys outside the gate. Oh, there's another collectible over here. Yes, yeah, the little red thing on the wall. Yeah. Yeah, I got that. All right, That's so it. I unlocked the door down there, so we got that. Okay. Red thing on the wall where? Yeah, it was where uh, we found the letter. Next to where the steel yeah. is, there was a little red poster on the wall that shows you the uh, the flyers. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Flashlight, seriously. Yeah, I don't know why they give you those. It doesn't take up any inventory space. Oh, there's notes on the wall over here. You can't pick them up, but you can read them. Okay. <laughs> Mushroom cloud. Well, why did you do this? Bolshev, how could you not care so much? Blood on your hands. How could you not see these machines would be the death of us all? You were supposed to be the genius. Okay, so there's not really much on the roof. Every cloud looks like a mushroom cloud, like the bomb just keeps falling over and over. I keep telling myself it's not true, but 
that just feels like I'm trying to run away from what I did. Every time I touch the machine, I can feel my emotions turn cold and distant. My body grows calmer, a break from the noise in my heart, but I dare not go down that route of coldness. I cannot give in. There's a lot of notes on this wall over here. Yeah! Uh, it's all lore. If I manage to gain access to the code of the mechanical units... Of the mechanical units, would I still be able to turn back the friendly version of the code. I have not found any of my soldiers alive, and I am no expert. Maybe it is all hopeless. I am glad that Phoenix saved me. I really am, but I cannot stop asking myself why. What made me worth saving? What about everyone else? Are the others? Are there others out there like me? So, what is the point of this quest? Like, I see a little hand marker, right? That I'm supposed to pick something up. There's a computer like, below you. Yeah. I'm not done here. There's another thing to do. There's a computer to go to. It's below you. Okay, Please I'm looking around. Please forgive me. So much destruction, so much ah. death from a single decision. Should I even be forgiven? I have the right to... Do I have the right to ask for such a thing? Yeah, there's like 15 notes on this freaking thing up here. I'm not going to read them all. Shit. There's sending more of those firebirds? We cannot let them establish a base in Hagabuda. These machines will crush us all. I'm too far away to make it. I'm gonna have to count on you now, okay? Okay, so we have to go someplace else. else. You can do yep. this. Okay. You ready? Shouldn't be far. Yeah. Uh, let me find it on the map. It's north of us. Just straight north. And oh I'm boy, fine. it's very north. Yeah, it's not far, actually. I did this walk before because I'm fat. Okay. Alright, we can go out the front door now. We don't have to go down and out anymore. Right? Or not. I guess. Yeah. No, no wait, the door goes to the computer. Yeah, we have to go down yeah. this way. No, we gotta go back out the way we came in. I've already started walking north. <laughs> it's gonna take me a while. I hear, Hunter. Yeah, I think it's glitched out. Wood. 